There you go. Nice and sweet. Cheers. You look good in the bath. Let me know if you need more bubbles. The events of the last couple days have been hectic. You got a very, very nice closet. I want a little bit more than the closet. I've been living in the five by eight. I want a house. You're very grateful. <laughs> it was nice to see Miley Grace kind of change the the tone of, uh, you know, what was going on with her, you know, being upset about the condition of the house. And I think it pointed us back in, in, in a little better direction. Why have we not had sex? You getting out of prison and everything else that's been going on, I didn't feel like I should pressure you. I haven't had sex with a man in four years. And I have definitely opened myself up to it. Scott has, like, an athletic body. He was a college soccer player. And you can tell he stays active, which I appreciate, because, like, I don't want to date somebody fat. <laughs> and with all the wine pumping through my system, I'm relaxed enough to finally go exactly where I want to go with Scott. If he notices, I mean, naked girl in a bathtub, Hello. Okay, well, I'm not pressured anymore. Oh, you don't feel pressured anymore? Okay. Well, that's good. Scott, take your clothes off. <laughs> you want me to get in the tub? Yes. Okay. <sighs> Perfect yellow bridge now. Mm. I got a charge. My just went off. Ankle well, I'll chalk it up to Murphy's Law. If something can go wrong, it will, and that just went wrong. It ruined my bath. I right. know. Is it okay now? Yeah, it's got a light charge. I just gotta sit next to a wall for two hours. We don't have to move away from the wall. The last time I had sex was probably around 17 months ago, shortly before I met Lindsay. And I've never been nervous with having sex with anybody, uh, but I honestly think Lindsay's probably about as close to a 10 as, as, uh, as I've seen. Hey.